In the past, when you played the Reagan Raiders, you had the game plan for the six foot three quarterback with the blonde flowing locks coming from underneath his helmet. But this year, it's the same player, but with a new look and for a reason that's deeper than what meets the eye. When I played Little League at the Panthers, I had a friend who was diagnosed with leukemia and you know, I wanted to help somehow. I'm nine years old, so I don't really have much money. So they said, just grow your hair. And I ended up raising like $2,000 that year for my hair through just asking people for money for that. And I've done it every two years since when it's gotten long enough. That's just a snapshot into who senior quarterback Gabriel Hollingsworth is off the field. On the field, he's the leader for the Reagan Raiders, someone that a few Division I programs are salivating over. The goal is perfection. It's the pursuit of perfection is what Coach McGee and I say. And it's, just, it's an every year thing. But Gabriel still has this season left before he can think about college. And there's a few goals that he wants to achieve before his high school career is over. The goal every year is undefeated state champion. Uh, hadn't happened yet. And then personal goal is, you know, conference offensive player of the year. Gabriel knows exactly what he wants on the field and in life. And the competitive atmosphere around football is something he always sees himself around. Right now, the goal is to be a, a college strength and conditioning coordinator. That's really what I want to do. That's, you know, everything I love to do. And it's got the competitiveness of college and, you know, sports. Gabriel Hollingsworth, our WXII Athlete of the Week. And you can nominate our next Athlete of the Week. Send an email to sports at WXI12.com or find Chris Lee on Facebook and Twitter. Just search for Chris Lee TV. That does it for WXI 12 News at 5. Don't go anywhere. Kitty Beck and Silva Vickers are up next with your headlines, weather, and sports.